Okay, I'm trying another new recipe today. This recipe is from a website called healthycanning.com. I will link you to the directly to the recipe when I uh, I'll put it in the description box. Anyway, right in here is three cups of chopped onions and a cup and a half of chopped bell pepper. Here I've got two cups of ketchup and two eight ounce cans of tomato sauce. And right here I've got, it started with four pounds of ground beef that I browned and it's draining right now. This is going to wind up being sloppy joe mix, not just the sauce, and it'll be ready for sandwiches when it's done. Okay, I've got my ingredients all in the pan. I've also added a tablespoon of mustard, a tablespoon of salt, and a tablespoon of sugar, and three-fourths of a teaspoon of black pepper, and two cups of water. Uh, I will be cooking this for about five minutes and then putting it in the jars. I'm bringing this to a boil. I'm going to turn it down simmer it for five minutes before I put it in the jars. Okay, the sloppy joes have simmered for five minutes. I'm ready to start putting them in jars. So here's my first jar. I'll fill this to the one inch head space. It smells really good. A bit more in there. Yeah, a little too much. Okay. Got vinegar on my paper towel. Wipe the rim. That vinegar, vinegar helps cut the grease off the rim. Lid and a ring. Let's set it right here. And that's it for that. So I'll bring you back when I get them all on the counter. Okay, the recipe originally stated it would make eight pints. Right here I've got six pints and part of another pipe, pint and a mess on the stove which I'll clean up shortly anyway let me get this the lid on here and then I'll talk to you about how long it processes okay I've got them in the canner ignore the gauge it's broke anyway it made six pints it was supposed to make eight I have this much left and we'll just eat that over the next day or two. I've got the canner turned on. Waiting for steam to come out. <clears throat> out the vent pipe right here. After it steam vents for 10 minutes. With good steady stream of steam. I'll put the weight on. And this will pop up. And it'll seal. And uh, as soon as the weight starts rocking. I'll set my timer for 75 minutes. I'm getting my steady stream of steam coming out of the vent. Yeah, it's, there's not much room in here, so there's a lot of stuff back there in the background. Anyway, uh, I've got my timer set for 10 minutes, and as soon as 10 minutes is up, I'll put my weight on. Okay, the timer went off. Put the weight on. This little button has already popped up. This is an overpressure plug. If there was, If this pipe was stopped up, anything else happened this will blow it'll just shoot out uh, if it gets too high pressure so that's what this is it's a safety feature your canner is not going to blow up it will not explode it cannot do it because if that didn't shoot off this certainly would okay when this starts rocking I'll time it for 75 minutes, an hour and 15 minutes. Okay, there we go. It's rocking now. 
I'm going to turn the heat down just a little bit so it stays rocking slowly. Set my timer for 75 minutes. And when it's done, I'll bring you back. Okay, there we are. Six pints of Sloppy Joe mix. Look at that jar boiling. Tomorrow I'll get them wiped down, put them on the shelf, get them labeled. It's after midnight when I finally finish this up, so I'm fixing to turn in. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Have a good night.